Boston, but the local fans that couldn't quite make the trip, well, many of them spent time at a brand new indoor racing track. And Courtney Jones is here with what uh, got their competitive juices flowing. Hey, Courtney. Hello, Kush. Welcome back from vacation. There's a huge karting culture here on the First Coast, and because of that, Jacksonville is the new home of the Autobahn Indoor Speedway. Off Phillips Highway, just north of Butler Boulevard, is the place for adrenaline junkies to get their fix. While thousands of fans flock to NASCAR at Daytona, quite a few Jacksonville residents stopped by the Autobahn Indoor Speedway this weekend to feed their need for speed. And I absolutely love NASCAR racing. If you want speed and you want fun and excitement and a safe environment, you get out here to Autobahn Speedway. Michael Hunt spent his Sunday afternoon at the 80,000 square foot indoor go-kart racing facility. It has two track configurations using electric OTL storm carts each capable of speeds up to 50 miles per hour. When you first you start out and they have one mode, you're going really, really slow, really, really slow until everybody gets the first lap around. Once the first lap's around, they hit you in the second turbo mode, and that's when it goes full speed, 40, 45 miles an hour. And it's just reckless out there. here are a lot more race oriented than they are in Maryland. That's where I'm from. I came from the track in Maryland and up there everyone's just like, oh yeah, bumper cars, woo! Everybody down here is like, yeah, race. Calling all thrill seekers and adrenaline junkies. There are no other indoor go-kart racing tracks like this, closer than Orlando or Tampa. So press the gas and enjoy the next best thing to being in an actual NASCAR race. South, NASCAR, left turns. If you can't get in a NASCAR race, then you need to get here in Jacksonville. I had the volume up so loud you actually felt like you were at a NASCAR race. But I must admit, um, I'm a little bit of a thrill seeker myself. So I hopped into one of those carts, put a GoPro camera on my helmet, and I went for it. Happy to say I did not experience any collisions, thank goodness. But in a web extra in the sports section of FirstCoastNews.com, some really cool video. You can go there and see me take a couple laps um, at the racing facility. And that way you can get an idea of just how fast the go-karts are really going. Chrissy Kush. Courtney, you are braver than I am. I think I'm going to take a pass, uh, but I'm sure others are going to have lots of fun out there. Watch out. Courtney Jones may be the next NASCAR driver. All right.